You can see the cranes jutting out of the East River and massive platforms on the river's surface. It's all part of the ongoing construction project to build the controversial marine transfer station on the Upper East Side. The neighborhood does not want it. I was shocked that they're going to do it right across the park. That's not nice. They should think about the kids, you know. Today, a report from the Independent Budget Office that, once complete, using this station to get rid of the city's garbage won't be cheap. Now, it costs $93 per ton to take the trash out to New Jersey. This method will cost $278 per ton. That's three times more expensive. This is a poor investment. We can spend two-thirds of a billion dollars on so much else. The community here has been pleading with the mayor to stop the project, arguing it's being built next to Asphalt Green, the sports facility where thousands of children play. Taking them here to the park with the garbage around is no, no, no. And the construction has already proven dangerous. A chisel suddenly came flying through the window at Asphalt Green not long ago. Hurt one of our employees. Had it come the other way on the field, it really could have killed kids. I'm hoping that Mayor de Blasio will take these new facts and dump an old plan from an old administration. But the mayor's office says the trash has to go somewhere, and it's unfair to lay the entire burden on boroughs like Brooklyn and Queens. His office saying today the mayor supports the five-borough plan because it's fair and equitable to all New Yorkers.